Oh man. Um. Um. Mm. The hardest part about being a mother is having part of you walk around outside your body, and you cannot. You feel like you want to protect it all the time, but they're their own person. Taking her everywhere with me, including Denver, Colorado, where I've never been before. The worrying, worrying about them. Just with their different activities and then the American lifestyle, trying to work and run your family, it's just it's too fast. You need to slow down. Whatever you say, they say the opposite. Not getting sleep. <laughs> and there's no book on how to train them. I mean, just being able to be an example for them and making sure that they thrive and that they get the love and the encouragement that they need to survive. Mm. I think the toughest part about being a mother is just the availability, always wanting to make sure that we've got time for our little ones, and not just time, but quality time. Discipline. <laughs> Discipline and probably just growing up with them and constantly finding a level that you can communicate. Um, I try to be their friend a lot and that gets me into trouble. So I got to kind of stay on my ground and have a happy balance of being a mom as well. It's always a constant battle between good and bad and what I say and what I want you to do and what they want to do. It's not having the freedom to go where you want to go, when you want to go. I actually have a son with a disability, so that's really hard. Um, just always being, always stressing out about a lot of bills and um, just trying to make it day by day every day for my kids. So it's, it's a little hard to take care of him and then take care of my other daughter. He has a lot of appointments and therapies and, and then a lot of complications. So it's, it's a little hard. And so if you're just torn all the time. Everyone's so rushed today in their lives and go, all the goings-ons of working and just trying to, you know, get money and everything. School, work, all of it. It's exhausting, but the time is the most important part. part is that it's the most fulfilling thing in the world. It's fun when you spend time with them and they make you laugh, definitely. Without kids your life is boring, so. My boys, my lovely boys, make it all worthwhile. Everything including taking her everywhere with me and experiencing everything with her. Just waking up every day to a new day and having to see what they can learn and see what they can teach you and what you can teach them and not have a dull moment ever, <laughs> ever. Oh my gosh, that she teaches me things every day. That's the best part. She, she's always teaching me lessons, and she is the best part of me. I mean, they test you to your limits, but they're a joy when you wake up in the morning. Having him keep me on my toes, <laughs> he definitely keeps me busy, so. You love mommy? Every little improvement that they make him, like him with his therapies and her with like school and just little things, learning how to read, him learning how to talk. Um, Cause they, they just make you laugh, make you smile, everything they do, you never know what's coming next. So, you can't even imagine it and they're all so different, all three of them. Oh um, man, she's always teaching me how to be kind and just to remember others and be patient is the main thing is patience. I can't think of anything more fulfilling, it's just incredible. I hope he plays football, or he's in the boxing um, college, and if he wanted to go to college, go to school and everything, and actually have a career going. That you have made a person able to take care of themselves, and hopefully a person who cares about other people. And they grow so quick, so you've got to enjoy it, because it goes so fast. Um, having my kids there every morning, and my kids uh, with me all the time. My for Mother's Day, my time is to spend with them and to have a good meal.